Hello, hello. Hello, hello, lads and girls. This is Lord Kicker, and welcome back to another episode of Fallout 4. Okay, so what I just did was I took over a base that is like right there. Uh, that's the only thing I've done now off camera. Let's see, let's have this loaded. You never know what might may wait us. FPS is going down like crazy. I think it was there I was blown up. I think most of those landmines are hidden by the leaves, actually. Yeah, there's the landmine. Oh! <sighs> I thought I could, like, disarm it or take it with me or something like that. Mm. Well... Okay, let's see. Bring up the map. Yeah, just continue on this, going over there, and then it's the straight road. I'm hearing gunshots. Is it in the city? Well... I guess it is best if we just leave it alone. Okay, so let's see here now. This is the road. Oh, shoot. Are those feral ghouls? I want to mess with any ghouls right now. Okay, I'm on I'm on the road. I'm on the road again. Dog, take it easy. Found something? What you find, boy? A TV dinner tray? Well, well that's kind of useless. Yeah, nothing good in here. I just keep hoping that those ghouls won't see me. Let's see. Just across this bridge pretty much. Can I just walk across it? Let's be a bit careful about it though. Don't want to walk on any more landmines. <laughs> uh. Hmm. 
Yeah, just straight forward. I think I heard a gunshot here too. Oh. Hey, come on now. Okay, stop it. Super mutants. And can I hit him? Oh, yeah. Nice shot. Oh, I hit him. Uh. Okay. Uh, are we clear? Hey, not eager to get into a fight with mutants, huh? Not really. Hey, can I talk with you? City? Just follow the signs. Signs. Protected by the wall. Okay. Uh, I'm glad those guys were on our side. Oh, a turret. Cool. Hey there, guy. That's a floating bubbly head. Outside the wall. Who the heck did I piss off? What do you mean you can't open the gate? Stop playing around, Danny. I'm standing out in the open huh? crying out loud. I'm right in target here. Nearby. They ain't a match for us, but we should be careful. Yeah. Uh. Diamond City, that way. Right now. Hey. You. You want into Diamond City, right? Who are you? What? Who are you? Shh. Play along. What? What's that? You said you're a trader up from Quincy? You have enough supplies to keep the general store stocked for a whole month? <laughs> you hear that, Danny? You gonna open the gate and let us in, or are you gonna be the one talking to crazy Myrna about losing out on all the supply? Jeez, all right. To make it personal, Piper. Give me a minute. But I never said I was a traitor. Better head inside quick before old Danny catches on to the bluff. Well, that wasn't very nice. This place, Diamond City. What is it? Oh, the green jewel. She's a sight. Everyone who's anyone in the Commonwealth is from here, settled here, got kicked out of here. A big wall, some power, working plumbing, schools, and some security goons are what make Diamond City the big monster it is. <laughs> oh, love it or hate it, you'll see for yourself soon enough. Let's okay. Go. 
Piper, who let you back inside? I told Sullivan to keep that gate shut. You devious, rabble-rousing slanderer. The level of dishonesty in that paper of yours. I'll have that printer scrapped for parts. Ooh, that estate... Uh, okay. Tyrant mayor shuts down the press. Why don't we ask the newcomer? You support the news? Because the mayor's threatened to throw free speech in the dumpster. What newspaper? What newspaper are you talking about? Mine. Public occurrences. And we're the hard look at the truth. So are you with us or not? Uh. Well, it's not this real none really of isn't any of my business. Oh, I didn't mean to bring you into this argument, good sir. No, no, no. You look like Diamond City material. Really? Welcome to the great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Safe, happy, a fine place to come. Spend your money, settle down. Don't let this muckraker here tell you otherwise, all right? Um. You two are, what are arguing? You two arguing about, anyway? Yeah. What do you think? Print lies and everybody's happy. But if you print the truth... <laughs> <laughs> now, was there anything particular you came to our city for? Um... Missing person. Trying to find someone. Trying to find someone? Who? Um... A boy. An infant boy. Kidnapped. Did you say kidnapped? Well, McDonough, Diamond City Security can investigate this. How about all the other kidnapping reports you've Don't heard? listen to her. Well, I'm afraid that our security team can't follow every case that comes through. I'm confident that you can find help here. Diamond City has every conceivable service known to man. One of our great citizens can surely find the time to help you. Sounds great. Who well, can help sure. And a mayor of a great city must know everyone. Who can help me? Well, uh, oh, who did good? One private citizen, Nick Valentine, a detective of sorts who specializes in tracking people down, usually for debts or whatnot. No, I have to get going. I'm sorry, Diamond City Security doesn't have time to help, but I'm sure Mr. Valentine charges a reasonable fee. This is ridiculous. Diamond City Security can't spare one officer to help. I want the truth, McDonough. What's the real reason security never investigates I've had enough of this, Piper. From now on, consider you and that little sister of yours on notice. Yeah, keep talking, McDonough. That's all you're good for. <laughs> I'm impressed. Not everyone can claw information out of McDonough's tight-fisted hands. Hmm. Why don't you stop by my office after you see Valentine? I think I just found my next story. Ah. Uh, okay. Story of the century. <laughs> Okay, so we need to go to Mr. Valentine. Uh, isn't there a way to zoom in some more on Diamond City? Hmm, maybe not. Okay, so let's see. Right about. Here you have some security. Uh, I don't really like that jump is on Y, but uh, I think I can get used to it. I doubt. What's up? Um excuse you? me. Keep moving, Scabber. Oh. Could I get some help from you maybe? 
Defending Diamond City is nothing me, my boys, the wall, and a few turrets can't handle. Okay. Uh... So, where is Mr. Valentine? Officer? Head on inside. Hey, Sullivan. So, you're that traitor Piper was talking about. Some tells me she's pulled the wool over my eyes again. Am I right? Um. This happened Piper's before. This before. All the time. Thing is, sometimes she's bluffing. Sometimes there really is a group of 50 raiders just over the hill screaming for blood. So I usually just let her in. Not this time, though. Mayor's on the warpath. Anyway, welcome to Diamond City and all that. I gotta get back to work. Huh. Thank you. <laughs> he seemed like a nice boy. Kinda sucks like that she tricked him, though. Okay. <laughs> Maybe this was what I was supposed to do, like, really go into Diamond City. Well, if this really is at w as wealthy as they say, it should be a pretty good side, right? Damn! It is pretty nice. Oh, level up. I have two levels to spare, even. Let's see. With this, I can convince people. I really want to get better at my aim, though. Gunslinger. Uh, spread all west, non-automatic pistol, do 24% more damage. Um... Shouldn't there be one for my aim? Uh, lock is measure uh, general food fortune and uh, for to reach rate of critical hits. Uh, affects your total health and action point. Frame from sprinting. Huh. Well, let's put one more in luck. And oh, it's level nine. Well, let's take endurance then, and then close. Okay. Paper sales. Uh, something tells me this is your sister. That motor is going to go soon if you don't replace it. Uh, you've been saying that for weeks, and the old girl still keeps cranking. Stop worrying so much. I head Diamond to City Market. Oh, that is a nice piece of meat. Oh, and a Nuka Cola. 
Nice little barbecue and stuff. Poor and stupid. Poor and stupid. Oh, don't act like you don't know. There's two types of people in this town: the ones living in the stands and everyone beneath us. I know everyone in the stands, and that doesn't include you. Now, why don't you make yourself scarce? Who are you, you anyway? Anne Cardman of the Cardman family, of the upper stands. If you haven't heard of us, that just shows how unimportant you are. Now, were you leaving or not? Sarcastic. Is basking in your delightful personality? Do what you like, but I'm done talking to you. <laughs> I hear there's a bar in the old theater district that's for Rest in hey there. Newcomer, huh? zone. Talk to Abbott at the Stay wall. Clear you. If you want a history lesson. Do yourself a favor and just say yes. It's all he understands. Uh. Hmm. Let's just back away. <clears throat> you read the paper. Damn sense. Hiding among us. Okay. Percy. Everyone else may be closed, but Diamond City surplus is open twenty four hours a day. Okay. Word is something bad went down in the old museum of witchcraft up near Salem. Why would anyone even go there? Abandoned forever. Hmm. Oh. Power armor station. Ooh, I can get a home here. That is cool. Whoa. Can't believe you eat that food. Only one thing worth buying in a dugout in, and that's the bulls. Hey there. The real Don't Diamond bother, City pal. boy eats it the noodles thing. I ain't heard nothing. Look, I'm telling you, it ain't just a story. University Point, that settlement on the coast, wiped out. I sense. Uh, what's wrong with you, guy? Why are you on high alert? I kind of like this place actually. Really? Swear. Looking pretty cool. It's real big though. No small little junkyard. Oh, they're breeding these cows here. Touch the paint. Um, I won't. Don't worry, I won't. Good. The wall keeps out the bad guys, so I appreciate you not messing her up none. Thinking you need a little education. Maybe a bit of community service. What do you say? And um, no right thanks. Everybody. I need everyone's attention. I would like to address the subject that is on everyone's mind. And that is the disgusting article Piper has written. Diamond City has stood united for over 150 years. And what keeps us united are two things. First is the great green guardian behind me, the wall, our protector and our savior from the filth of the outside. And second 
is our faith and trust in each other. Uh. Faith and trust that has given us prosperity, security, and education for every citizen. And while the paper might well, a wall isn't always a good thing. We will not betray this sacred trust. Now, I want everyone to hear these next words very Trash? I uh, don't know why that's red though. <laughs> like anyone wouldn't mind me stealing stuff out of the trash can. Excuse me. Okay. You there! You need a genuine, authentic, custom-made hickory swat. No, I don't. Well, anyway, I'm gonna end off the episode here. This place is awesome. I love it. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this episode where we finally got to Diamond City. And I hope to see you all in the next one. Until then, bye-bye.